This is a shooting coming just 18 days before the anniversary of the Uvalde school shooting and with three weeks left in the Texas legislative session. The families of the Robb Elementary shooting have spent nearly a year calling for change. Four bills, one to enhance background checks, another to expand safe storage requirements of guns, and a third that would raise the age to purchase an AR-15 from 18 to 21, as well as a bill banning red flag laws are all stalled in committee. But a few that increase penalties for felons found in possession of guns are still making their way through the legislature. Now, today, state Democrats will join Uvalde families at a news conference in Austin demanding action on those bills. Texas Governor Greg Abbott not scheduled to be in the Capitol today. He did address gun control yesterday on Fox News, pointing to mental health. The governor says he supports legislation that would add $3 billion to the state's mental health funds, though he did not specify which mental health resources would have stopped this shooting. We know that many of you that were at the mall on Saturday had to run for cover, leaving behind your car, personal belongings. So we do want to make sure you know you can get your car back today. From 10 o'clock this morning until 2 this afternoon, you can go to Edge Skate Park and you'll be transported to outlets. They're asking for one person per vehicle to come. Our coverage will continue at 630 this morning. And of course, we are staying on top of this story around the clock, both on air and online. You can go to WFAN.com or use our mobile app. Still to come on.